Woodland man is taking on quite a do it yourself at home project and not everyone's on board. He's an avid sharpshooter and says he wants to build a high tech private gun range inside his garage. Taylor Vito spoke with that man and Taylor, he will have to get approval from the city first before this can happen. Well, yeah, Joe, that's because currently city code doesn't allow indoor gun ranges inside residential areas. And you'll notice behind me, you see that building over there. That's where he wants to put in the gun range. But you'll also notice it's really close to some homes. Not everyone's thrilled about that. Bill Dunlap loves to shoot. Of all the guns I have, this is probably the most accurate. Having shot since he was a kid, it's one of his lifelong hobbies. I probably shoot about once a week. But that weekly ritual of keeping his aim sharp can take its toll. Dunlap says he has to drive at least half an hour to go to gun ranges in the Portland area. A lot of driving there. Out of all that commuting came an idea. And that's kind of like why I'd like to have a indoor shooting range, target range, uh, here at my home. Dunlap wants to make a gun range that's secure, soundproof, and up to NRA standards, he says. There would even be an HVAC system for fumes, all inside his garage and shop building next to his home. Doing all of that will cost roughly 60 grand. I usually like a straight shot, so it would be standing from this end of the building, I'd be shooting down towards that end of the building. Now, currently, Woodland City Law wouldn't allow something like this. So Dunlap approached City Council and asked if they could work with him. Currently, city leaders are looking at an ordinance that would allow regulated indoor shooting ranges in residential areas. I'm ready to build, ready to go. Not everybody is as fired up as Dunlap, though. One of his neighbors sent this letter to the city saying he's concerned for his kid's safety. He worries property values could take a hit and that it would be noisy. You won't be able to hear it outside. Dunlap disagrees and says he'd hire an architect to design the range to make sure it's safe and built the right way. And at the end of the day, he wants to be able to enjoy a hobby he's passionate about just steps from his home. Because I'll know I'll be able to, to do it in my own environment that's controlled, that I know that is safe. And I'm looking very forward to that. The ordinance was discussed at a recent city council meeting. The matter was tabled, though. The city will now have an independent third party person come and look at it to make sure everything is well put together. Back to you.